You know, I am by ident identification. I usually joke a little bit and say I am a Viking. You know, I was born a Viking. I, am, I don't have red hair, but, and I, of course, you know that they didn't have horns anyway. You know. So my identification is that I am a Swedish. I am from a small province, not far from Norway, but I'm a Viking. I was born and raised um, in, 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 in that part of the world. I am proud of being a Viking, even if, you know, <clears throat> you know the country, um, the country has Volvo, ABBA, the zipper. We invented the zipper, which is a good thing. And then we invented the seat belt. You don't think about that, but that you think about that every time you sit in the car. And we, in, well, we, we didn't invent, but we have Ikea. <laughs> Ikea was invented in Sweden, started in Sweden. And we have the Nobel Prize. I'm, I don't want to be boasting, but I'm just saying small things like that. It is not about that identity that I want to talk to you, of course, today, this morning. You remember, you remember another place where Jesus talks about identity. And it's very imp important for me because I surrendered my life and therefore I will tell you in a moment how I look at my life now. But l remember in Matthew 16, there it says that Jesus is, is together with the disciples and then uh, he, they came to the district of Caesarea Philippi and he asked the disciple, disciples, who do the people say that I am? Remember that? It's a very, very, very important moment. Who do the people say that I am? And the disciples started saying, well, some people, people think you're John the Baptist, Jeremiah or Elijah, you, you know, whatever. And, 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 and I think maybe they thought that, you know, at least, you know, this is this. We passed the test. And then Jesus says the very penetrating question. He says, but who do you say that I am? Oh, I love that question. Who do you say that I am? And who do you say that I am? That he is. It's a very, very crucial question. And you say, and, and, and you can almost feel the disciples <gasps> holding their breath. And then, and then comes Peter. And he says, you are the Christ, the son of the living God. So Peter makes a correct identification. You know, the Christ means you are the Messiah, the anointed one of Israel. I, I loved, by the way, I loved what you had on the front here before, where it says what, the names of God, uh, the names of Jesus. Wonderful, because he is, he is the I am. He is the Alpha and the Omega in the beginning. And the, but here he says, you are the Christ. You are the Messiah. You are the anointed one of Israel. You are the one to come. You are the, you, you are the one that, that has been promised and you will fulfill. And, 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 and Jesus does not rebuke him. You know, if, if the answer was incorrect, Jesus would have said, no, 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 no. But he didn't. He says, he didn't, he didn't, he didn't do that. On the contrary, he elevates and clarifies the source of Peter's confession.